page seven. Okay, uh, make sure that you have the handout downloaded if you haven't already uh, done that. And if you turn to page seven, we're gonna go into equipment replacement decisions. And here we have a new drill press. And the purchase price of the new drill press is 230000 So that is going to be money going out. So we're going to be paying out 230000 So we'll put a minus here. Now the whole reason why we're looking at the new drill press is that we can get some savings over the old one. In this case, we have annual savings or yearly cost savings of $50,000. So we're going to do $50,000 every year for the next five years. So the total savings here. thousand dollars per year times five years gives us a total savings over the life of it over the five-year life of it of two hundred and fifty thousand dollars <laughs> That's supposed to be a dollar sign. All right, so we're going to have cost savings. $250,000. And that's going to be a plus. So we're going to pay out for the purchase of the new drill press. But we're going to get back these annual cost savings. So over the next five years, we're going to be plus two hundred fifty thousand. Now there's one more thing here. If we buy the new drill press, we can sell the old one. So the old drill press has a current value of twenty thousand. Well, if we buy the new one, we don't need the old one. So. We'll sell the old one. So we'll have another plus twenty thousand. And again, the only, only reason why we can sell the old one is that we bought a new one. So, buying the new one allows us to sell this old one. So, if we add all these up, so our total negative 230,000 plus 250 plus 20,000. Uh, just as a uh, sometimes it's easier to do the pluses first and then subtract out the 230. That's what I'm going to do. 250 plus 20,000 and minus the 230,000. So 40,000 and this is a plus. So if we were to purchase the new drill press, we would be $40,000 better off over five years. So should the automated drill press be purchased? 
Yes. And how much additional income will be realized? Well, uh, 40000 so be forty thousand dollars better off. <laughs> That's my new way of writing wood. I'm trying to save on L's. So the company would be uh, $40,000 better off. Right, page eight. Now, if um, you want to pause it, you can to see if you can try to work this on your own. Same idea, a little bit different format. Here we have a new scanner. It costs one hundred twenty thousand, so that will obviously be a negative. So we have to purchase the new scanner for one hundred twenty thousand. It's going to be a negative. Now, we're going to have some annual cost savings here, but they don't come right out and tell us, so we have to calculate it. The most of the old scanner, look at the annual operating costs 55000 and the new one is only fifteen. So, we are going to have a savings, the difference between those two. So the old one costs 55000 the new one only can cost fifteen. So how much savings are we going to have? All right, well, let's first figure out how much we're going to save each year, 5000 Minus fifteen thousand gives us forty forty thousand dollars. So our annual uh, cost savings are going to be forty thousand. Now here's the thing: it's going to we're going to save that forty thousand dollars every year for the next five years. So, uh, put it down here. So our cost savings will be forty thousand every year for the next five years. So forty thousand times five years. Is that 200,000? Yep. All right, $200,000 will be the savings over the next five years. And again, if we purchase the new scanner, well, then we can sell the old. So this old scanner we can now sell. We have the new one. And the current value is 38000 so if we're going to buy the new one, we may as well sell the old one. Of uh, 38000 So let's add all these up. Total. 
and again, I'm going to take the positive numbers first. It's just easier for me, anyways. So 200,000 plus 38,000 minus the 120,000. 118,000 plus. So. Would we rather would we purchase this or not? Yes, we'd be one hundred eighteen thousand dollars better off. So one hundred eighteen thousand dollars better off over the next five years. I'm going to throw in an L on this wood here, just to. Just to go back to the traditional way of writing the word correctly. All right, so the company would be $118,000 better off if they buy the new scanner. So that's the equipment replacement. decision.